Hey, Stephen, this is Paul Hitt with Grass Fire. Just wanted to uh, say it was great to meet you in the BNI group again. And um, I just want to show you this quick video of your website and show you exactly what uh, I look at when trying to get a, a site to rank high in Google search and just what some opportunities are there for you. I mean, it's, it comes down to three things. It's uh, 100 or 1,500 words of content on your page that's keyword rich. It's targeted to what the actual search is going on in our area to bring you uh, business. It is backlinking um, and looking at your, the strength of your backlinking, the amount, the quantity, and the quality of those. And then citations, which is your name, address, and phone number listed in all these directories across the internet. So what I look at is on your site. I've got it pulled up here. And, you know, it's a nice looking site. You guys have a great looking site. Uh, what I don't see is enough content on it. And when I say content, I'm looking at everything from, you know, what is this, uh, this photo named you can see it's just named a bunch of numbers um, I put keywords in those that's just another way that I do this I look at in the words is it targeting specific search and I'll show you what some of those are here in just a moment going on in Fayetteville Northwest Arkansas and such um, and and what we're trying to do is just get enough content on here so that Google recognizes you as the authority in our area and that they rank you high based off of that so the keyword rich content is uh, the, the first thing that you guys are lacking. Um, if you look at where you guys are, I just typed in roofing Fayetteville AR. Um, looking down through here, you can see Perry roofing. You can see Brown boys. Um, looks like AD roofing, um, Richards roofing. There's a lot of them here. I don't see you guys listed. Uh, there's Pinnacle, uh, My Assurance, NWA roofing. So you can see that you guys are not on this first page um, in Google search and you want to be on this first page, Google and I rank as high as possible. Google will give you anywhere from two to 30 for 7% of the calls coming your way. If you're based on this first page and if you're in one of these uh, first three positions, it's even better. The second thing that I want to show you on this uh, search term right here is just the, this is what we call the map pack. You want to be listed on this as well because a lot of people will click on your website straight from this. And Google's really pushing this map pack, and that's your GMB listing, your Google My Business listing, getting it optimized well, getting it uh, a lot of power and a lot of juice. So that puts you in the first three positions here, and then you want to be in those first three positions down here as well. So how do you get there? Um, the first thing I said was that 1,500 words of content, that's, that's the best place to start. Um, and then along with that, I'm going to show you your competitors' websites. Here's Perry Roofing. You know, it doesn't look any better. I mean, your guys' website looks better. They just have a little bit more content and are targeting um, some of that search. But again, what I'm seeing is not beatable. I mean, not unbeatable. These guys are totally beatable. If you look at Brown Boys. They spend a little bit more uh, time on getting the, the right content on theirs. And, you know, you can see just like roof repairs, roof replacement. These are terms that um, it's going to be found in Google search. But even them, even their site is not... Um, you know, unbeatable. I mean, they just have a, they have a little bit more on there, but again, I'm not seeing that it's fully optimized for the Google search going on. And so looking at your website and looking at the strength of it. So there's this UR and DR, and this is a program called Ahrefs that I use uh, to measure this. And so I look at your website strength. I look at Perry Riffing, who's in the number one position for Fayetteville or Riffing Fayetteville AR. I look at their website strength. And then I look at Brown Boys and you can see they're, they're all 28 to 2.8 and 24 to 4.5. Um, these are things, this is their domain rating and, and their URL strength rating, and, and it's just not uh, super strong. So they're getting ranked there because they've done enough to get by and get in that first two positions, but they haven't done enough to get um, to keep from getting beat and to keep from uh, having the other guys play, you know, play catch up to them. So if I look at the three things that this is showing me, it's showing me all the keywords you're being found for. It shows me how many backlinks are coming to your site and where those backlinks are coming from. And then I can drill down into these and see the strength of that. But just for instance, looking at your organic keywords, you're being found for Pro Construction, Trade Pro, of course, so that's in your name, ProCom, Roofing, Trade Pro, uh, Trade Construction Company, Snow Pros, Arkansas. Um, not a lot of this is specific to, this is what I want to find right here. Something like this general contractor Springdale AR. I want to find, um, plumbers in Northwest Arkansas. If, if you're trying to get ranked for plumbers or Northwest Arkansas plumbers, if you're trying to get ranked for that, um, I want to find plumbers Rogers AR, if you're trying to get ranked for that, but, you, but your ranking for that is in 71st position. So you're on like the, you know, eighth page of Google, um, 
plumbers NWA 52 and you're falling, 53 and you're falling. Um, general contractors, you're in 42nd position. So this is where you want to find get get built up into your strength because there's some serious volume that happens. This is search 80 much 80 times a month for that search term. North of Arkansas plumbers, 20 searches a month. Um, your site's really optimized more for plumbing than it is for roofing right now. Um, Northwest Arkansas roofing, seven, 70 searches a month. This is a bit higher uh, keyword difficulty, that 17, so it's going to take a little bit longer to get ranked for that. But again, you want to target that. You want to go after that. Uh, plumbers in Fayetteville AR, you're in 78th position. Um, that has a five difficulty and 80 on the uh, uh, vo search volume. So you can start to see like, okay, Arkansas roofing, there's 20 searches a month, pro plumbing, uh, I'm not sure what that is. But you can see that there's just a lot of volume here of the search terms, and that's what you want to get ranked for. If I look at Perry Roofing, and I look at their organic keywords, and here's where they're beating you guys, Roofing Fayetteville AR, 90 searches a month. It's a higher KD, but they're in the number one position for that, and they've really targeted that. Northwest Arkansas Roofing, 70 searches a month. Um, if you look at Roofers Fayetteville AR, see just adding Roofers instead of Roofing will get you, you know, 60 searches. If you look at roofing companies, 60 searches. Roofers Springdale AR, 350 searches. If you look at NDBA roofing, 30. So you start adding up all this volume and you start to get into thousands of searches per month and you're just trying to capture a piece of that to get, um, get your phone ringing more than any of your competitors. If you look at Brown Boy, same thing. They're gonna have um, some of these you know, gutters, Northwest Arkansas, they, they've targeted that. Zero KD, so super easy to capture that and beat those guys. 40 on the volume. Uh, Northwest Arkansas Roofing, again, they've got that. Roofing companies in Northwist Arkansas, Roofing Payable AR. So they're targeting some of the same things that Perry is doing. So that's where you guys wanna be. That's the space you wanna play in because that's where the, the most search is going on. If somebody already knows your name, they're gonna, they're gonna find your website. We're looking for those people that don't know you guys and how do they find your website and how do they click on you guys and get some, uh, get some traffic coming your way. So if I look at um, the other things I talked about, citations. So citations are the back, or citations are the the links that are through uh, online directories. And so there's you know Facebook, there's Manta, there's Better Business Bureau, there's all of these different directories. There's thousands of these on the internet. You, I can use another program called WhiteSpark. I can look exactly what your competitors are, are um, what what citations they have and what you have. And then what I like to do is usually they're in the like 30 to 40 range. And I like to go past those guys, way past them, um, and have them playing catch up. So I'm gonna add a, I'm gonna match what they have, and then I'm gonna add another hundred on top of that, so that you guys are are just a lot stronger in your ranking for all of the search that's going on. And in Google's eyes, you look um, like you're the best, like you're the the most authoritative person for roofing in Fayetteville. The third thing are those backlinks, and this is what I want to show you guys um, how to do this. So if I look at the referring domains for uh, say Brown Boys Roofing. And you can start to see where the strength is from the referring domain. So you've got roofing companies, some blog posts there, that's giving them some power. Uh, this top rated local, that's a that's an online directory that they've got listed and it's gonna give them a little juice because there's a link coming to your website from that. Uh, homeownerideas.com, uh, Mathis Roofing is somehow linking to their website. ATM roofing um, is linking to their website. These may actually be ones that they own and maybe uh, other links out there that they've gotten uh, access to nwapublic.com. Again, so I'm looking at all of this strength coming on and how do we beat that? So again, what I'm seeing here is not, um, not really strong. And so I wanna go after that with those guys. Um, if I look at Perry Roofing and I look at their strength, same sort of thing click into the referring domains and I look at this and I see, okay, this Neurostar, that's an online directory. It's gonna give you a lot of power, but it's only coming from that one domain. So they're gonna get a little bit of juice off of that, but we can get that same exact juice um, on, on that one. So uh, WBSRCH, I'm not sure what that is. But again, a little bit of juice coming to them from that. Um, it's probably an online directory. Most of these are online directories and, the, and you get a little bit of power from that. What we want to find are backlinks with more power. So a Pizza Hut referring to you guys is not going to give you the same strength as, say, a roofing trade organization or a roofing blog or something like that because it's or construction blog because it's going to refer back to you guys and it's going to be Google's going to go, oh, this is from a roofing 
um, trade organization, they must be more important than, say, a Pizza Hut. So that's kind of how that works in a nutshell. Um, you know, I, I build out a custom plan for how to attack um, all of this search volume and, and what you need to do exactly to your website. If you're interested in, in finding out more or if you like what you see here, then just hit me back and give me some feedback, um, either via email and we'll set up a time to talk. Uh, really would love to help you guys. I'm looking for a roofer in Northwest Arkansas, like I said. And um, right now I'm, I'm, I've got one in Texas I'm working with and, you know, just starting him out and going to be pushing him up in the rankings. And I can do that for you guys too. So uh, you can reach me at 479-326-7899 or just reach me back out on the email and we'll set up a time to talk. Thank you.